what's up guys this is gonna be part one of my uh, my build pretty sure some of you guys have seen it but these are some of the recent updates i did on it i i threw on a new bumper i got the side skirts and then i'm still debating on the on the the back bumper if i'm gonna leave it stock or uh go after my i still don't know yet but let me show you guys a little bit about it damn that's just dying already bro. yeah yeah So here it is guys, let me see. So right now, like I mentioned before, it's completely gutted. Like any other 240, right? So completely gutted. I got my bright seats. And then uh oh, shit. get this open for you guys completely gutted got my battery relocated to the back and uh, yeah as far as interior guys I completely gutted it uh, the only thing I really do have in here right now is just the seats and my dashboard and my center console um, the plans that I do have for this thing is uh, I do want to paint the interior completely white that's one of my the colors I have in mind, I'm so I eventually do want to throw in a roll cage, and then, uh, but as far as that, I gotta wait up a little bit. One of my buddy, I gotta hit up my buddy and see what's what he'll hook me up with. He's he's one of the guys that uh, did my uh, my two front. I'll show you guys a little bit about that. Right What's up, food DSM boy? We just arrived or what? That's right, dog. You already know. Fuck <laughs> stupid ass cars that break down every day. What happened now? Oh, I don't even fucking know. That's how bad it is. My gas ran out, dude. Your gas ran out? Yeah, I was at the E line. That's why maybe earlier it didn't start, but because my gauge is fucking off. Like, I, I got out of work. It was at the bottom. Then I was making my way, went to like one fourth. So I'm like, what the fuck? So I just filled up, just in case. Cause earlier it smelled like like fuel. I don't know if it was because of the spark. All right, guys, you can see my sick ass RV. That's for sure. Sink as RV, right? <laughs> what do you say about it? Are those spider webs? The fuck? It's a 244 that should never run, so it's always sitting and shit. Like I mentioned before, I got my battery relocated. The reason of that was because I got my got my wheel wells cut. I got my uh, front end tube. I uh, I had crashed it before, so I took it to one of my buddies, and uh, he redid my whole front end. Did a badass job. Restitched my uh, strut tower. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, yeah, right there. And you guys can see the bodywork. I'll probably post pictures of how it looks without the bumper and all that. But if you guys need any, if you guys are in LA and you guys need any work, any, any welding work, any two fronts, anything, bash bars, rear bash bars, I'll put the link on the on, my, on the bio so you guys can hit him up. About the about the quarter panels yet. I, I personally love stock quarter panels. The only reason why I'm debating on throwing the the quarter panels is because on this side, got this nasty ass fucking tent. I don't get to see it. Shit. I don't get to see it on the video, but let me tell you guys a story about how I got this uh, this fucking hit right here. So, me and a couple of my buddies we went out drifting one night, and uh, one of my buddies with a Honda decided to tag along. And he seen how we were having fun, and uh, decided, to, decided to drift his front wheel drive Honda, fucking uh, swung around the corner, pulled the e-brake, 
fucking jumped over a curb and fucking hit my car, my luck, right? And this was actually the first day I actually fucking caught the car when it was completely stuck. Scrape gang die or what? So this is it for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Any comment, any feedback, anything you want you guys want to talk about, let me know. This is one of the first vlogs I've done and uh, I'm gonna keep on going, <clears throat> keep on going, keep on doing them. And then I plan on doing uh, other vlogs for some of my other buddies' builds. So uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and share.